Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Erin and I'm a Pez collector and I've been collecting Pez for over 20 years. That's a long time. I know, right? I recently went on a Pez hunt and I thought it would be a lot of fun to bring you along with me. I went to World Market and Five Below and I was really on the hunt for the new Christmas Pez, the Nutcracker and the Elf and the Full Body Santa, but you're just gonna have to stick around to see if I found it. Let's go shopping. The new Space Jam ones. And of course, uh, where the collection starts with the Bugs Bunny. Does everybody's collection start with Bugs Bunny? Mine did, so. Yeah. I might need to get this one. If you don't have Space Jam Bugs Bunny, then you better get it. <laughs> and the Tweety, which everybody loves from uh, watching Seinfeld. And then this uh, basketball player, because you know sports. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I had that. Frozen one, but I don't know if I had that. Or Star Wars. Getting those? Hello Kitty ones are cute, but I think I had those. What are you getting there? Decided to get some. Hello Kitty Mermaid. Yeah. That's cute. I guess I'll get this one too. Got a little rainbow on his ear. That's yeah, super cute. <laughs> Wait, we gotta always check for the gold SpongeBob. No. The which one? The gold SpongeBob. <laughs> All right, we got some goods at World Market. Yeah. Where to next? I think five below, maybe. All right. gotta look for the ones that like aren't all scratched up or dented and then that the corners look pristine especially if you're not opening them oh wait there's peppa there's princess peppa there's george and there's pirate george so i need i need george just a plain old pig Name George. <laughs> Those all have friends. Oh, there's one in the there's one. There's George. It's pretty cute. It's a lot of pigs. Have everything else here. Yeah. No luck on the Christmas. Uh, not yet. Ooh. Hey, fellow Puzz collectors! It's Aaron from the future. I'm just editing the video, and I just realized that I kind of just leave by below, and I don't say anything like, "Did I buy any Puzz? What did I buy? I don't know." But spoiler alert: I go to Michael's in a couple days, and you're gonna see that clip here in a few seconds. Just left Michael's. I was looking for the new Santa ornament and the new like Nutcracker and Elf dispenser and I was successful in getting some stuff. I got a bag here but I didn't film inside because everything was up by the cash registers and there were a lot of people in there so it was a little embarrassing. 
like getting out my phone. But when I get back to my studio, I'm gonna get everything out and show you my haul from today and from our previous trip to World Market and Five Below. So stay tuned. Well, that was super fun. Hopefully you enjoyed going along with me on my Pez hunt. I'm gonna show you a few things that I got. Let's start off with Space Jam. Here's the Tweety. I think this one turned out really cool. It looks like the old Tweety really needed a new update and that's what we got. So in the Space Jam, there was there's Bugs Bunny, there's LeBron James, and there's Tweety Bird. So there's three in this series. I think it's pretty cool how Pez added on the back of here what ones are in the collection because a long time ago they didn't used to do that and you'd be like uh there might be one or two more but you never knew especially before the internet that's a good addition so it's pretty neat next up we have Bugs Bunny which I think this is a really good update as well I really I really like the new Tweety and Bugs I think we really need that and like I said in my video my collection pretty much started back when I bought my first Bugs Bunny Pez. And, you know, I pretty much just like everybody always got Pez for Christmas and Halloween and stuff, you know, my whole life. But I think when I was in middle school, that's when my Pez collection really started. I remember way back when I was in middle school and we used to walk or ride our bike down to this like little drugstore or pharmacy place by my old house. And I remember going in and finding that Bugs Bunny Pez and buying it. That's when I knew I just had to keep collecting Pez. I mean, <laughs> what a fun hobby to have. And last but not least in this Space Jam series is LeBron James. He's pretty cool. I don't always like when they have like the real humans. I know he's based on, you know, a real... Uh, I almost said hockey, a real basketball player. You know how much I love sports, <laughs> but it's pretty cool. I mean, LeBron, he's probably, he's probably stoked that he has his own post dispenser. It's kind of like getting your own Funko Pop. That's it for the Space Jam. Next up, I bought some Hello Kitty ones. This little Hello Kitty mermaid. It's pretty cute. And on the back here, it shows all the Hello Kitty dispensers in this Hello Kitty collection. How many times can I say Hello Kitty? So it looks like there's Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty Rainbow, which I also bought right here. I thought this one was really cute. It's got like a little rainbow on its ear. You know, and then there's the Hello Kitty Mermaid, and then there's the Hello Kitty Bee, which I didn't see, and there's the Hello Kitty Unicorn, and there's a Hello Kitty Llama. But I actually have those already in my collection. So I have them here I can show off as well. So I just wanted to show off the Hello Kitty dispensers that I have that I already opened previously. So here's the Hello Kitty Llama, the Hello Kitty Unicorn, and of course the Hello Kitty Rainbow one. I also found the Peppa Pigs. There's four Peppa Pigs in this collection. There's this one, Princess Peppa. And then there's just regular Peppa. It's got a little bow tie. And then there's George. Everyone's favorite pig, George. <laughs> I don't know anything about Peppa Pig, but these are cute. And there's Pirate George. Arr, midi. It's pretty cute. And on the back here it shows what ones are in the Peppa Pig collection. And then for my Michael's trip, I found, I think I already had this one, but I bought it again. It's the polar bear with the little hat. I really like bears, so I bought a couple of these so I can open them up and put them throughout the house to decorate for Christmas. I thought it was really cute. And then I got the new elf, which is a little, it's got a little red outfit on. Oh, that was pretty cute. And on the back here it shows in this current 2021 Christmas collection is Santa, a snow globe, an elf, tree, reindeer, and snowman. I already have all the other ones in this collection, but these are the new ones that I got this year. And my big find of the day from Michaels, the dispenser 
I guess it's a dispenser that I've been looking for and I've been looking forward to ever since I found out that they were coming out with it is this Santa ornament. I mean, how cool is that? On the side there it shows you know, how you can load it. So I guess it is a dispenser too. And it says, hang your dispenser on the tree. And on the back, it's not much, it's just the ingredients and nutrition. But I think this is a great addition to the new Christmas collection this year. I'll look for a picture online. I don't have it, but there used to be an old vintage full body Santa. Now this is an ornament. I'm not sure the other one was an ornament, but I think this is really cool. I can't wait to hang this on my tree. Now it says limited edition ornament dispenser, which is pretty cool, but it doesn't say how many that Pez is actually making, which I kind of wish that if they're going to put limited edition on something, they should put you know, are they making 5,000? Are they making 20,000? Because I do collect Pez. I mean, I like them to hold their value. A lot of my Pez I don't open just because uh, I like them to hold their value. And also I like the card design. I am a graphic designer, so I appreciate all the time that, you know, a designer put into designing the packages for Pez. And I think that's really neat, but I love this. Here's our limited edition Santa Claus ornament dispenser. Let's open it up and put it on the tree. Oh, pretty cool. Oh. He's, <laughs> he's glued on to the candy. comes with a lot of candy that I won't be eating. It doesn't come with anything that I see that you hang it up with. So I did find a paper clip because it's a little too early for Christmas decorations yet. <laughs> so hopefully this works. Is that fancy? Nice. <laughs> Let's go put it on the tree. And when I say tree, I mean Christmas cactus, right? Hopefully you enjoyed my first Pez vlog video. I have a whole lot of ideas on videos I can make about Pez. I'm always buying Pez online. I buy Pez from eBay. I buy Pez from Pez.com. So I'm excited to share those with you. And just wait till you see this. I gotta run downstairs. Hold on. Here are the new shelves. I'm gonna be filling these for days and days with Pez and collectibles. Do you think I have enough room now? Hopefully I do. Well, here's just a small portion of some of my vintage Pez I'm gonna be putting out on these shelves really soon. These are some of my favorites. There's a soft head Batgirl, and there's a soft head Batman, and I don't know, Mr. Ugly, Goofy No Feet, and one of my all time favorite Pez, the Casper, because it has the die cast uh, sleeve. See how it's cut out there. Love it. The monkey music maker. And I think this is the mimic monkey. I like the mimic monkey a lot. A pony go around. It's a pretty good one. And a Dumbo. All kinds of stuff. There's layers. Oh, there's layers on layers. Oh, this one. Love it. A crocodile. Pretty fun. So I have them all stacked in here nicely. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Hopefully we won't have anything break or anything, but um, I had to move them pretty quick. We'll be putting all these up on the shelves and a lot more. 
But I think putting all my pets up on those shelves is going to be a huge project and hopefully I can bring you along so you can watch me, you know, decorate and fill up those shelves with Pez. And if you can't tell, I mean, I have tons of other collectibles. I'm really into Star Wars and Greg, who you saw earlier in the video, he loves Star Trek. And um, so we have lots of Star Trek and Star Wars stuff. And I have a lot of Funko Pops as well. So that's going to be a lot of fun, you know, putting all those collectibles on my shelves downstairs. So stay tuned for some of those videos. And I don't know, just anything about Pez that I want to talk about. I have like thousands and thousands of Pez and most of them are downstairs in bins right now because we just built these shelves. So I can't wait to get those out and show them off with everybody. So there's going to be a lot of good videos coming up. So if you like to watch Pez videos and you like collecting Pez, then stay tuned because I'm going to be making more. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye. Pow!